Thanks a lot for coming along with Life with Belsif. Let's see what's really going on. How you doing today? Welcome to Life with Belsif. I'm your host, Belsif. 93 out right now. She's warm one. I haven't shaved in a few days. I feel like Grizzly the Adams and it's poking the f*** out of me. Too hot for that. So we gotta go home and maybe take care of that tonight. It's been a long day. Leave a comments down below if you've had a long day today. Anybody ever try Cherry Pepsi? Kind of addicted to it, which isn't a good thing because pop's still good for you. But my God, that's cherry Pepsi is delicious. <sighs> not too bad. Uh, Have you ever tried Pepsi Blue? It's not too bad either. Oh, f red light. Why wouldn't we have a red light? Oh, wind's blowing. She's with her boyfriend and she's wearing a mask. Figure that one out, Jim. Fire and Minds want to know what's really going on. Here, check it out. How you doing? How you doing? Why wouldn't you? Why wouldn't they? You're never safe from the dirty old Bilsif when you're in front of the rig. I'll get you. Oh, buddy, hang on to your 300 C or your C300. Eh? Him? Oh, you dirty bastard. You got me. Get a goddamn red light. Frig! All because of that guy. What have you done to me? Cock me right over. Frig! Just had to lay on the brakes. Oh, then we got another buddy here. How you doing? Norkage. It's on the old Norkel. Oh, wouldn't he me? We got another Chevy Silverado beside us. <gasps> He's got the fast one. GMC, sorry. My my apologies. GM C cap. Long weekend coming up. What's everybody got planned? Leave your comments down below if you're Canadian. I don't know if the US has a holiday this weekend or not. Should be ashamed of myself for not checking up on you guys. Hurry out, let's go. There's JJ. Body shop. How you doing, Jamie? Hey, you freaking do it, bud. Uh huh, you're still at work, I'm not. Hey. Hey. We're going kind of a different route today. I told the daughter I'd give her 20 bucks if she cleaned the house. So I looked on the cameras and she looks like she tidied up the kitchen. That's about it. So she's not getting 20 bucks. She's getting half of that. Maybe. I might even just give her a fire spot, depending on what she's done. Hey, sometimes you gotta freaking put the foot down, you do. How you doing? How you doing, bud? <laughs> Careful. Oh. 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 I noticed that there's a few stickers up around Cerny, Ontario of Life with Dilsum on posts and stuff. So whoever's putting those stickers up, thank you very much. Why wouldn't you? I never put stickers up anywhere. Do you believe me? Why wouldn't you? Or it would. Could be. Might not be. But I don't think it is. I know it's not. Dead skunk. Why wouldn't there be? But we're heading down London Road here. This is called London Line. This is where all the people come and stay in hotels. On our left over here, we got East Court Motel and Blue Water Motel. On this side, we got Gables Inn. There's some real friggin' treats in these motels, let me tell you what. We got Palace Inn Motel. We've got Motel, where the hell it said there. I missed it. We've got Willie's Inn. Nothing like a good Willie's Inn. So we got that one. Oh, we got one over here. Look at that one. That one's about the best looking one on around here, but there are some pretty decent people staying in them motels. Let me tell you. I'm not being sarcastic either. They're decent people. They're not too bad. Maybe. Maybe not. I'm not sure. I'll let you comment down below and let me know. Oh, God. F me. Got tractors and f***ing cars breaking and people doing nothing. Let's go. How can we not be going faster than a goddamn tractor? What's really going on? What are you doing, dingle nuts? Frick, he's hauling some butt. How you doing, bud? What the hell do you want? Hot day, huh? Yeah, it's not too bad. Not bad? No, you're still giving that air conditioning. Well, I'm not in air conditioning, though. Where are you now? I'm in my truck in the air conditioning. <laughs> I quit that place. I said, F you guys, I'm leaving. Oh, well, you got your work done. What the hell? That's right. Yeah, I was talking to Dennis yesterday, right, about his boat. Because one of the, a valve guide went, and the, the valve went through the piston, and the cylinder walls all scored. So the motor junk. He's got to rebuild it. Yeah. And that's but he wants it. to put superchargers on it. Oh, yeah. Why not? It's a part. <laughs> so you should call that boat. Go faster. Okay, we'll talk to you later. Okay, Bill. All right, John. No. We talked to the old man, we did. <clears throat> Poor Dennis. Who are you, bud? You're going to yank that motor right out of the boat. Ah, oh, dick. No goody. Why in the F? Car minds want to know, where the hell do you learn how to drive? Some people. Hey, if you know you're a shitty driver, comment down below with a paragraph or two. And you know if you're a shitty driver or not, be honest. 
Like if you pull out and say, oops, if you say oops a lot when you're driving, or if you say, oh, then you're a dumb driver. So just admit it and put it down below. Why wouldn't you? Let's see how many people are actually honest. I'm a good driver most of the time. I have my own little dick up little thing I do, but hey, it's only because I can't see anything at that moment. It's either there's a car in my way or there's a dude in my way or there's a crate in my way or stuff like that. If anybody's got a shipping container, I just thought of this. Send it to me, would you? Hit me up in the comment section. I'll give you my address. You can ship it to me. I don't ask for much. Just a shipping container. That's it. I never ask you guys for much. But when I ask for it, it's a big son of a bitch. Let me tell you what. I'd like to get myself a shipping container and put it beside my garage for more storage. Ooh, yee. Smells like somebody just shit their pants. Ugh. Oh, that's rough. Really rough. Yeah, I haven't really got much to say today. It's kind of one of them days where maybe I shouldn't have made a video. That's why I do videos every other day now. It's too hard to think of content every day. It's actually ridiculous is what it is. And I've been wanting to spend more time with my family too, you know, that's, me. that's another reason why. When I do a video every day, no time, none. And every other day, not too bad. The corn is just about ready to come off the fields. Almost time for sweet corn, but I can't eat it. Leave a comment down below if you can't eat corn, it gets all stuck up inside your asshole. Sucks. I want corn so bad. Ugh. Ooh, just gonna have to have zucchini instead. I love the zucchini. As Vice Grip Garage says, bleep bloop your comment down below if you like zucchini. Hashtag Vice Grip. Hashtag bleep bloop. If you haven't watched Vice Grip Garage, go on over there and check out Derek. He's pretty good, he is. Look at this guy. Just want the itch to go. Just do it. Let me smoke you. Oh. Just peel your front right off. Could have. Should have. Might have. Well, we got some slow pokes here. We're gonna go from 110 down to. 80 you watch speed limit is 90 let's go you can do 190 for god's sakes i'm off friday four day weekend for me you ever notice when you have a four day week how long it takes it feels like a six day week I'm telling you right now this is life after death we are punished because we did something wrong in our previous life so we we're sent back to work our whole life until we die almost I'm telling you this is life after death what did we do in our previous life to deserve that grow up work your whole life and then die that's your punishment. Why, thank you. Unless you love your job, then it's not punishment, right? You're sent back because you did something nice. What's going on over here? Oh, hey. Oh, it's a painter boy. Some lime painter guys. Getting some El Fuelski. We're almost home. I'm gonna sign off here for the night. Hopefully you enjoyed the little chat with me. I'm glad you're all here. Thanks for being here. Thanks for subscribing. Welcome any new subscribers to the channel. And until next time, you know what to do for now.